Welcome back to Ages How You Wear It. Well, it's been a minute, guys, and I miss you. Oh, well, you know, life is as it is. You just got to shut down. <laughs> you, I'm quite sure, know how it is. If you're new here, welcome. Welcome and thanks for stopping by. Please hit the like and subscribe if you like the content and come back and see us. Uh, please join my butterfly family. And for my OGs, thank you and for always stopping by. I really miss you guys. So I do have some looks today and I am filming today. So you will see more than one video. So come back tomorrow because I'm going to have another video vlog style. Um, I wanted to show you some outfits. The color I am loving for the season is orange. I have fell in love with orange and I wanted to show you a few orange outfits I've been wearing. So let's get started. I got my iPad so I can remember what I wore. Because um, sometimes I be forgetting. I don't know about you, but I be forgetting. Uh, let's see. So the first outfit I want to talk about is this caftan. Okay guys now whether it's orange by itself or orange with another color you see right here and this is probably where i'm gonna put it this calf can is calf 10. i said calf can i don't know it's a calf 10 yeah so look at the aztec designs in it that's what got me do you understand me? And you see, I wore it with heels, or you can have it flowing down to the, you know, put on some flats and just have it to your, you know, on not dragging, but on the ground. But I wore it with the heel of the day, which I will show you in a minute. But anyway, look at these Aztec colors. So gorgeous. It's not like any other caftan I've gotten. It, I just love the design. So now this is the type I'm looking for. You know, you got to go through a few to see, hey, what do I really like, right? And you know, a caftan, you can wear anywhere. I could wear this to work and you would not know it's a caftan. Put it on with some black flats. It's a dress. A caftan, even though back in the day we wore it as house dresses, it is still a dress and you can stop if you can if people can go and buy a five hundred dollar pair of pajamas to wear outside don't tell me i can't wear a caftan to work put your blazer on belt it because i did one with the blazer and a and a uh um i did one at work with a blazer i showed when i put the blazer on on my video but I tied it in the back so you could not, you couldn't even really tell that it was a caftan, but nobody knew until I told them what it was. So, uh, yeah, some people liked it, some people did not at work. Everybody loved it. I'm saying when I presented it, because you know, once you present it to the world, everybody has their own opinion. And it doesn't bother me. That's okay. If you want to have your own opinion about it, that's fine. Because you know, people, until you, until somebody have, I guess they say until somebody says something negative, you just haven't even arrived, I'm assuming. So the person said, you should have put it on with a belt. I know that. I've worn it with one. You should have put it on with this. You should have did that. Okay. You think this is the only time I'm wear it? But me personally, I don't, I don't put negative comments at all on nobody's page. If I don't like something, I just move on. I don't. Why do I have to say anything? So people who feel like they have to say something are very judgmental people. I'm sorry, that's the way I see it. What I liked about this also is, you see this blue part here? Let me show you something. On the inside is a belt. And it 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 uh, controls this blue section. So you can make it tight, you can make it loose. And then it'll fit you a little more snug. So I like that too. And I cannot remember who I bought this from. I can't. Because you know I do a lot of live sales. I can't remember. I joined a lot of live sales. So 
I, I can't remember who, who I bought it from. And I'm so mad about that because I like to give people credit. And this is gorgeous. So that's the first orange, but with all the color blocking, with all the different colors. And let's see. So let's talk about the style of the show. I told you I would come back and show these shoes that I got from Amazon right here. I wasn't about to pay 700 to 150. I think it's the highest I've seen is 1200, I think. 12 or 1500 for some platforms. No ma'am. No ma'am. I got these right off Amazon and they got them in um, other colors. And but once I buy it in one color, I really don't want it this shoe in another color because I'd rather get another type of shoe in that pop of color because the next pop of color I'm looking for is a because I got a green I got the orange um I got purple so the only thing um is maybe a really cute pink as a pop of color because I got other pink shoes but I'm looking for a pink and yellow boot that's what I want and that's what I'm gonna get I'd rather have it in a boot but look at these and they are sexy. They are sexy, guys. Ha Nowhere near the price. Nowhere near the price. So, you see I wore those with that calf can. And I wore it with this next outfit as well. I found... Let me see, is this it? Yeah. I found these men's dicky shorts in... Um, in the thrift store i saw the orange and i just went right for it i was like that is the perfect orange is this not the perfect orange and i hope it's coming out as true orange as it is and it was too big but you know what i said i can wear it high waisted just wear it high waisted and it fit wonderfully as you see here, when I'm styling it, it looks so good. And I had this orange blazer already. So I wanted to do an all orange look, but of course I paired it with a black bodysuit. Um, and then I realized I had an orange one and I could have had a full orange look, but I didn't even, I forgot I had that orange bodysuit. So I went on the water black. And it still worked out pretty good. And it looked so, matter of fact, here's the blazer. Because I wanted to show you this whole look. It's so nice that I wanted to show you the whole look. So I thrifted this blazer as well. It's a Banana Republic blazer that I thrifted. And I just like the structure of the blazer. It's not too oversized. And it just looks so pretty and as you see it looks really nice with this even though the orange is too different uh one is a darker orange than the other it worked out perfectly fine and with them shoes so cute and you think i'm not gonna wear it again in the fall really i'm gonna this time instead of wearing it with the orange shoes i'm gonna wear it with some black boots yes i will all right, and with that outfit, because I love that whole outfit. I really did. This thrifted scarf. This thrifted scarf that I got at a thrift store for like a dollar. Look at all the rich, beautiful colors in that orange and blue, yellow. So beautiful. And I am just falling in love with these type of scarves. Finding these and wearing them around your hair uh, around your hair around your head can i ever go a video without saying something crazy but i'm quite sure you miss your girl and you say you so crazy girl <laughs> but anyway and tying this around your head so if you have a bad a bad hair day or not tie this around and make it cute either in the back put it to the side it is an accessory, so you can make it look and do whatever you want to with it. You can even tie it around as a belt. So see beyond 
what they tell you you're supposed to wear something as. It's a scarf. Wear it on as a scarf. No. You can wear it as anything you want. And if you get it big enough, you can wear it as a shirt. Which, once the summer comes, I am going to style a lot. I found some good... Um, I found a lot of good scarves to wear as shirts. So, you'll be seeing that as well. Okay, so next is... Well, I also wore that blazer with this outfit and I wore with one of my favorite pair of jeans. You see them all the time. It is my men's H&M jeans. Yes, men's. <laughs> men's jeans. I just love them as long as they got something, you know, extra. So it can't be just a regular men's jeans. And when I saw this with it cut out in the knees, I was like, yes. So I wore that with, and I still got, if you've been following me a while, I still got my Balenciaga kitten heel um, pointy uh, knife. They call them knife because how, um, how pointed the toe is. And these are the, um, what do they call them when you do a lot? Graffiti heels. So, yes, I still have them. Still look brand new. I bring them out every now and then. You got to have the right outfit. And I think that was the right outfit. And these still, and they will remain in my shoe collection, whether other people wear them or not, or whether people say, oh, my God, that is the ugliest shoe. Thank you. But since you did not pay for it, it's okay. <laughs> so I wore these with that outfit. So I thought those were a perfect touch. And it does have a little orange in it, but you can't really see it. But the jeans, this just popped out. And that's why I like wearing it with jeans and just have it pop out. And, and I think I like that look. So next, let's see. Oh yeah, this outfit here. I found this once again at a thrift store. And it's the details in this shirt to me. This is a, what size is this? I think it's a 3X. Oh no, it's a one size for anybody so that they always oversize. And of course, I wore it as a shirt dress. Because of the splits, you have to wear something with it. But you don't, I mean, do you? I don't know. You may be tiny enough that you would belt it and just wear it as a dress. But me, I had to put on biker shorts and I'm so into my, I only got two pair of biker shorts, one black, well, three. One black, one faux leather black, and one uh, pink. And those are the ones I'm going to wear all during the summer. Sure is. And it's long, but look at the details, guys. This is what I like coming up here to show you. You see a picture of someone in something, but it's the details all around the sleeve. It's the tie-dye. It's the details in the front of the shirt. And it goes all the way around each sleeve. And then it flows down in the back like a shell. And then it has the intricate details around the back as well. This shirt was, I don't know, $7. And I'm going to wear this during the summer because I didn't told you that my color is orange. So I'm going to find other ways to wear it. And of course it flares down at the bottom as well. And I, you have to belt it so that it won't look oversized and big on you. But this is so cute. I color blocked with accessories. So I took this outfit right here and this pink shirt that I got from New York and Company years ago. And these white pants that y'all have seen me wear a thousand times from H&M, they were long and I cut them and distressed them and I wanted to make them um, to where they look uh, 
shin length. I know it's called something where it's just to the shin. But anyway, it's just to the shin so that you can always see your shoes. And I wore that with these. Another almost like kitten heel, but tall, a little taller with these uh, Dolce & Gabbana color blocked. They're color blocked with uh, black, white, and orange. So these stuck out to me as well. And of course I got them off of the secondhand uh, vestiaire uh, where you get secondhand luxury items. And I fell in love with these just as soon as I saw them and got them for the price that I wanted to get them in. So these are the shoes and the outfit that I wore to bring out the orange and the uh, with the pink and the white. I thought that this was an excellent look. So yeah, so see these are the inside. There it is, Dolce & Gabbana. And it has it also on the bottom. And they have been worn, but not a lot. Um, so they were a good price and a good look and i wore that with these earrings that i got from a seller that sells a lot of handmade jewelry and i got this orange owl and it has the orange the black the gold and the orange is my color excuse my nails guys i haven't done them yet which I am greedy to do because I'm greedy to continue filming, but I want to get this out today. So these are so nice and cute. Look at that. They bring out, you know, the accessories was the look. Okay, so it was the accessories that made that color block look. So you can put on just the accessories and color block and you'll still get a very nice look. Um, I think that's it, guys. Yeah, I think that's it. So that's all the things that I was going to point out about that. Uh, let me show you the bag I wore with that. The bag I wore with that short set. They had a half price sale at a consignment store called Fifi's. And this bag was $14. Look at this bag. Is it not gorgeous with all those beautiful colors? And this was everything. When I saw it, I was like, what? Half price sale? Okay, I'm going for it. And look at those beautiful colors. I can wear this in the summer, in the fall. That is my how to style orange. And be looking out because I'm going to style more. So follow me on Instagram, which is where I show all of the outfits. Because um, you see that most of what I'm showing you here is on my Instagram. I'm just showing you uh, the look itself. So let me tell you what I'm wearing. I'm wearing my um, my Givenchy, 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 Givenchy. We want to say Givenchy, but I think it's G Fon G. Anyway, my, uh, let me get closer. My vintage pearl drop earrings. And I have on my lip, my Dior um, rouge. And my Dior brooch. I hope you can see it. And then I have my little... Um, I call it the little bow, little Christmas bow brooch. And they are both in that pretty, uh, very elegant look. And then this shirt is from H&M and I just love the collar that's on it. So that is what I'm wearing today. So guys, ah, I will see you next Saturday because I will have another fashion video for you since I've been skipping on my fashion videos. So don't forget to watch me tomorrow on my Ages How You Wear It vlog. Follow me on TikTok, Ages How You Wear It. And I have a blog called Ages How You Wear It. No matter where you are in your transformation, you are still 
a beautiful butterfly. Bye, guys. <laughs>